Paul is responsible for his company's email archiving system. They used to archive email using journaling, which stores messages in a special external mailbox. When Paul joined the company, journaling to a third party was pretty much the only choice. But it had problems. The process of getting messages into the external mailbox can alter them and even open them up to intentional tampering. That made Paul a bit nervous. To comply with discovery requests, Paul might have to reconcile his journaled archive with his exchange data. In other words, he would have to search both mailboxes. No easy matter if you're talking about millions of messages. Also, journaling only captures email and meeting requests. Other calendar items don't get archived, nor do tasks and contacts, all of which can be important for discovery requests. Paul could use a third-party add-on to capture that data. But he'd have to manage it separately, and it might get in the way of future exchange upgrades. For all those reasons, Paul replaced journaling with in-place archiving. It's built into Exchange. No third-party software or separate archives are required. Messages are preserved exactly as they were when the user last sent, received, or edited them, including metadata. Exchange can archive all the items in a user's inbox, so everything is discoverable, not just email. It even preserves folder structure. Best of all for Paul, with in-place archiving, he only has one system to manage. He trusts Exchange with mission-critical email, and now he can use the same system for archiving.